Hey, what is up guys? My name is Moondog and welcome to a new horror game that we're going to be playing on the channel. Uh, The Quarry. It's, I guess, it's, it's not like Until Dawn 2, so it's not like a direct sequel, but it's made by Supermassive Games, the same people that made Until Dawn, which is, to a lot of people, one of the best horror games out there. For me, it's not. In terms of story, kind of, but in terms of gameplay, uh, not so much. I find Supermassive Games... Um, to be a little boring on the gameplay side. It's just a lot of walking around um, A lot of like blocky like just not good movement control just all around the gameplay in supermassive games It's just really boring <laughs> It's just a lot of walking around looking for little shiny spots that you can interact with picking up a piece of paper or picking up a Just some type of item key item in the story or you know that the game throws at you so um I'm a little iffy about going into this. The story looks really fun. The cast of characters, like the cast that they have in this game is like really fucking impressive. I mean, Until Dawn had a pretty good cast, but the quarry looks really good. But I just am not a fan of Supermassive's gameplay mechanics. That's the reason why I can't get back into the um, Dark Anthology. Like, I'm sure the stories are great and what they're, you know, what they sh shit out, you know, you know was good but i just after a little hope even though the story was good the gameplay is just so bland so i'm hoping the gameplay is somewhat better in this um well yeah we'll see but yeah welcome i'm ready to get into this man i'm ready um agree i agree man this moan use license music um streamer mode sorry but I'm good. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what this game is about. It just looks like a really fucking like cheesy 80s movies type thing. David Arquette, alright, from the Scream franchise. We know him. Evan Evagora? I don't know. That person. Maybe familiar, I don't know. Skyler Gassando? Oh, Ted Ramey. All right, Sam Ramey's brother. Miles Robbins. Austin Sage. Justice Smith, he sounds familiar. I know faces, just I don't know names. I know Brenda's song. Sweet Life, baby. Hmm. It's very beautiful. What is this Evil Dead type fucking thing going on? Someone read from the fucking Necronomicon? The Book of the Dead. Grace Zabriskie. I don't know who that is. June 24th, Laura. 2350, Route 919. Okay. Why'd you kill the music? Oh, it's... I think you know why. Um... I don't think I do. Begins with an L? Like the L word? Loser? Lesbians? <laughs> lost, Max. We're lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's debatable. Okay, I know his face. I just don't know his name. Whoa. Safety tip number one, quick time events. What the hell? Take a moment to consider the following as it will guide you through the various twists and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you oh. see here are quick time events. Quick time events. Teams, okay. Which will help you to act at <laughs> the right time. Watch your step. 
Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place oh. if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Oh. Take your eye off the ball in a two spell disaster. Okay. The path you tread is yours to choose. But that doesn't mean there won't be uh, obstacles along the way. There's something behind you. I, f I failed the first quick time event. Oh, heads up. Oh god, this is Yeah, honey, nice catch. Thank you. Man, the roads are definitely getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp experience. Oh, right. That's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. Facial you know, ah, I don't like that. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Dude, didn't everybody know fucking knows this. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe. Yeah, he doesn't me. deserve it, though. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Why is it hard for super... Oh... Pick left pocket, pick map. Uh, pick map. Uh, voila. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, how do happen to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. Uh-oh. No of course not. Okay, let's see. So we are... Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. Have you seen any signs for it? Dude, can you look at the road, please? Can you hey, look at- eyes on the yeah. road! Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck was- Oh, okay. What was that in the back? There was something in the back seat. <laughs> If there's one thing Supermassive does well with, it's it's the jump scares. It's it's giving you a good scare. I will admit. Yeah, I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? That was what? not a bear. No, no, Max, that wasn't a bear. What was it? It was a person. Yeah, that was a person, 100%. Are you serious? Do you think we hit a person? No, you dodged him. I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. Did you guys notice the person in your back seat? I think you forgot that you had a third person with you on your trip. What is it? I really have this car up. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh. uh I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, no. He's... Oh, no. Also, sorry, the game is really dark. So if it's hard to see stuff, you're not alone. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. He's alive. Okay, so... Ooh. Turn unlocked. Interrupts. Press L1 to view. Oh, never mind. Snoop? Oh. Uh, I think if you're interested in the university. Why didn't you tell me? Oh. He got rejected. He's hiding it. Who the fuck needs college, man? Fuck college. Thanks, honey. Yeah. You're gonna do great Can things, man. Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. There you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? 
uh, they don't want to catch on fire. Yeah, that's better. Well, anywhere's better than here. Oh, uh, he still needs the light, you fucking person. Oh god. Oh no! Creepy old lady in the woods. You're not gonna react. Oh, you're not gonna say anything. You Just over here. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Are you my boss? Um. No, just hurry up. Can you just hurry up? God, Max, hurry up. What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. You didn't Are see you serious? Th Yeah, I, I, they could be hurt. I don't know. I don't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Oh, but you I didn't see did. her. I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. Why? Just why? Okay. Luck with the car. Ah, splitting up. Splitting up. What a great idea, man. What a great fucking idea. Oh, the fool. <clears throat> The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one. Don't we? <laughs> Innocence and freedom. Or recklessness and risk-taking? <clears throat> uh, spontaneity. Eh, I don't fucking know what that word is. Sorry, I'm a dumbass. Uh, actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think and don't get burnt. Does this game have a system like Until Dawn or like the Dark Anthology where... There's certain items you could pick up to see into the future to prevent a certain character's death. Oh, this might be it. This might be it. Hey. Um, harem, harem, garum poster, prologue woods. This is a poster for a traveling sideshow. Looks like it's been here for a while. It looks like it's been here a while. I forgotten in the woods. Are those burn marks on around the edges? Hmm. Oh, why is there a question mark? Weird. The music's good. Definitely like an 80s type of horror movie type music, you know? Left or right? Le left, left, we'll go left. Ooh, I chose the right. Why is there just a suitcase? Or is that just a box? No, that's a suitcase with... Es escapology trunk? Trunk filled with strange devices that is that, that of an escapologist, perhaps? A relic of a traveling show that must have passed through the area. Okay, so that's old. Oh, why did you do the camera angle on that? Oh, is that a no? That looked like a house or something. Pretty sure it was just sticks. Oh, okay. Was that cutscene necessary? Ooh. Okay, I get it. Silas, what does that mean? I hear you, donkey. My headphones are really loud, by the way.
Oh! You didn't see... Ah, one of these is gonna be a fucking face. Fuck you. Whoa! Run, girl, run! Uh oh. Oh, yeah. Ew. Oh shit! Yeah! Hey, 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 what's wrong? What's wrong? Is everything alright? Holy shit. Talk to me, what's going on? What's going on? There's something out there. Like, I was. There was noises all around honey, me. Honey, 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 take a breath. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals. It's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just. Leave, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's yeah, go. let's get out. Don't kill these characters just yet. Huh? Yes, there we go. Burn like a kid. Max, come on. Here we go, here we go. We're getting out of here. Are you kidding me? Max! I just, okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've got to go, Max. All right, you're not helping right now. Can you just, I am trying to get us out of here. All right, enough! Just... I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's okay. Gotta stay calm in this situation. Can't be yelling at each other. It's gonna get you nowhere. We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Ooh! Oh! Fuck. Oh my god, my heart just exploded. Hi, dude. Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. What's we're on his neck? What's, uh, what's on your neck there, bud? What'd you do? Oh, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Toy unlock path chosen. Path chosen. Heck, it's warriors full of twists and turns, unknown okay. paths, and unexplored wonders. Okay. With each step taken, you tread a path of your own, matched with its very own consequences. Okay. There will be moments throughout your stay that show you that the choices you've made, the path you've chosen, could have gone another way. Okay. At Hackett's Quarry, there's no such thing as the wrong way. But be warned, some paths are more dangerous than others. Okay. So, Butterfly Fleck, you aren't really going to know. Okay. Yeah. Um. Something jumped out. No, be honest. If you're honest. We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it. So we swerved and. There you go. Just be honest. Here we are. Why lie? Something jumped out. Yeah. It's called the woods, dude. Animals everywhere. Honest. Uh, I'm sorry. It was, it was so dark and it happened so fast and they were gone. I... They? Ma'am, did you hit someone? No. Dude, no, we don't no, know. Of course not. But, you know, I mean, I don't think so. But... Sir? Have chosen. Uh oh. The car running. Sir? Cop seems anxious. Well, I'm not gonna lie. Like the all time scariest cop? Yeah, he is. I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. Well, in that little cutscene, it didn't look like we hit anybody. It looked like we actually swerved out of the road. Hey, thank you, officer. Thank you, officer Ted. Now you folks want to tell me just what in the hell 
you are doing all the way out here this late at night. We're heading to camp. We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. Where are you, counselors? You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out, you know? And they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. You're not gonna make it to Haggard's Quarry. Oh! Not tonight. Oh! Why? Avenger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night. Okay? Why does he have blood on his uh, neck? I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Um, compliant. Okay, fine. Yeah, we'll head to the motel. Understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait. What? What? I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map there. Okay? I don't have to step out of the vehicle to do that. I could just hand my sure. my man. Son, remain in the vehicle. Okay. You're telling me I can't just hand my man the map and then you take the map and point us in the direction? So, we... Are right about here. Harbinger Motel is here. Why is your okay, eye closed? Just fucking... Well, I'm sure the fine folks... The Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. Hmm. Right. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Wait, but, but what if there's someone out there? Yeah, I'll have a look. Good night. I don't like that cop, dude. He is not fun. He's leading us to a hotel so that these, so whoever runs that hotel can fucking kill us. It's fucking Bates Motel, dude. I'm gonna get fucking psychoed in the shower. Ted Ramy is fucking scary. And I only know him from fucking Spider-Man. <laughs> Why is this guy just sitting there? Because he's really trying to make sure. That guy was weird. He's giving me major weirdo The dude needed like at least a dozen shots. Oh my god, I know. Was that, <laughs> Did you see was, was that blood? Yes, that was blood, 100%. Nice to meet you. He's not going to hear you. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here, please. All right, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night, thank you very much. Agree. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's Quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know, kind of tricked him into showing up. <laughs> very slick. Nice. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? No! Honey, you no. really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. <laughs> Let's the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Thank you. Oh my god! If he called me ma'am one more time, I was going to shove that badge up his dick hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I've got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I... 20s debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. <laughs> okay, we're done. 
Yes, go straight to the fucking camp. That hotel is nothing but bad business, please. Heck, it's Quarry, summer camp. 1226, June 25th. No we drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This, this is the difference. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll be at the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What a pussy. Is anybody home? Open the damn door. Well, we tried. All oh, the lights are on. Hey, the lights are on. I hate this and everything about it. Oh, it's the different. Ca I can't see anything right now. I, oh, I hate it. I hate it. It wants to set it up for a fucking jump scare. I'm not dumb. I know I know these fucking developers, dude. Fuck, dude. Hmm. Um, hold on. Can I go over here at least? It is so hard to see. Oh, that's an owl. It is so hard to fucking see. Display, please. Like, I literally can't see anything. Okay, that's a little better. Like, I literally couldn't see anything. Like, you guys, it's a little bit brighter, but for me, it is so dark. Why is there just a big yellow door way the fuck over there? Oh god, I hate this. I hate it, I hate it. Treehouse? What? Boathouse? Alright, that's where we are, the car park. What doesn't kill you, make you stronger. Makes. Mm. It doesn't kill it doesn't you. Doesn't kill you. Will make you stronger. Will make you stronger. Lord, okay. There's no one here. Come on. Just give me one more minute, okay? I'm not going to that fucking hotel, dude. Let's try the basement. Okay. What the fuck? Hey! Hey, are you okay? That was just a naked ass I'll man. Be right back. I'm gonna get some help. That was a naked ass man in the basement. Max! Max, get over here! What's going on? 
There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. Hey. Wait, what, what are these? I don't know. You just said tools. <gasps> Why didn't you just bring... Look, there's someone in there. Look. I'm looking, I am. There was there was definitely someone there. Okay. Okay. So Take hammer, take wrenches. I'll take the hammer. Hammer time. You sure? It's gonna be super loud. Oh shit. Um urgent. So no. Who the fuck who else is gonna hear us? Plus I can I can use this as a weapon later. Wow, that was super loud. <laughs> you need a hit? Yeah. You've seen Evil Dead, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Basement is the best place to be. Hello? It's gonna be blood going into light bulbs, coming out of coming out of the pipes. It's gonna be raining blood here in a little Are bit. You hurt? You exist? Are you hurt? You exist. Hey, how about we pick that hammer back up? Hey, be careful. Or not. I picked up the hammer to fucking use it as a weapon. Ian. Hi, Ian. Oh, shit. Oh, that's a dog collar. This bloody collar looks to be too too big for a dog what kind of dog would be called ian anyway that is weird all right all right that is weird oh what the fuck max 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 Maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I swear. Hey. It's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... Ooh. Max? What the fuck? Max. Oh they god. No oh no. Oh. Uh help. Oh shit. Ah, tits. What the fuck attacked him? Like the 
damn Harbinger Motel to use! Every little movement, every little thing you do, is a sleight of hand that commands my heart to love you. Every little movement. So I already fucked up. If I just went to the hotel, they probably would have actually been safe. So the cop, in a weird way, was trying to make sure we weren't going here. What? Okay. I kind of maybe they were gonna die either way, but instead of like I don't know. Hi, Birdie. Hello, my friend. Hello. Welcome to the show. Oh, you're we the lady. Friends, aren't we? No. I've waited for you. Mm. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves... Damn, get away! Mm. Don't have to get so fucking close. I don't want to kiss you. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Oh. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting. Yes. And terrifying. But... This is the terrifying, if most terrifying thing enough, in a game. If you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. You're the terror lady that we found. This is the card we found. That it is. The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't me. we? Me. Innocence and freedom. All recklessness and risk-taking, spontaneity, actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think, and don't get burnt. I can show you more if you'd like me to. Sure. This is what might come to pass. A possible future. Mm. A path yet unchosen. <laughs> there are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover. On which I can shed light, if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Mm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. It's Quarry Forever, Chapter One. Sounds cooler saying it like that instead of saying Chapter One. You know, heck, it's Quarry Forever. August 22nd, later, kids. Yeah, summer camp entrance. Forever. You. 
Do you know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. You never know. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, working these things out. Yeah. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me. Okay, spell it. I'm not gonna spell. You know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. <sighs> so she dumped her ass, huh? Hi, Emma. Hey. <laughs> okay, this is, um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Mm. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will you? Yes, boss. They're Say not going to Emma fit. For me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Ah, uh, Brenda. Brenda song. I love you. All right, all right, all right. Oh, good, there is a... Run button. Hey, dude. I recognize you from Detective Pikachu. Hey. <clears throat> hey, what do you uh, what do you listen to? <laughs> Good to know. Good to know. Fucking asshole. Well, you know you shouldn't be by that uh cellar door. You know that, that uh, 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 you know? Yeah, he knows, he knows. Alright, so it is the same typical gameplay, but... Again, story. It's interesting so far. I'm gonna keep with it. Jesus Christ. Hi. Hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um... You know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's Dylan, come it's on. broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's, I gotta get the last bags in there. Come on. with this thing? It's just Dylan, please. Sorry, bro. Sorry, bro. Cool. Thanks, guys. Dude, you didn't even actually try to stop them. That's kind of your own fault. Okay. Camp plaque. Why? How is that a clue? We know where we are. This shit do be beautiful. A little bit of, a little bit of full. Oh, skill. It's not. That it's not really skill if you're literally just going through a window. Stop trying to act all fucking cool. Ugh. Horror. I hate horror. Oh well, you're in a horror game right now, dude. So sorry. You're gonna experience a lot of horrors here soon. Where the fuck do I go? I'm gonna miss a lot of shit, aren't I? Jesus Christ, this place is huge. Oh God, hold on. Can I turn? Here, we'll turn that down just a little. But can I like turn down? Can I turn off motion blur? <laughs> um. Yes, I like subtitles, but I also really don't like, I really don't like, oh, you have got to be kidding me. I don't like the motion blur. It's a little, ooh. I'm also not a fan of this uh, camera angle. Hey, dude, what's up? Okay, really, dude? Locking me out? Okay, in my defense, A, it was Dylan's idea, and two, it was really funny. Oh, yeah, right. Is that is that right? I don't write the rules, man. Okay, whatever. Look, are you going to help me with the bags or what? Nah, I got to stay here and wait for Mr. H to return our cell phones. Sorry. Jesus Christ. He okay, took away I, your cell why phones? Why are the stairs locked? 
Well, apparently it's to keep raccoons and other pesky varmints from ransacking the place. Mr. H's words, not mine. Oh! Boring! Yeah, raccoons. Sure. Do these people know something that we don't? 100%. Is that you, Dylan? I can only deal with one shit at a time, Jacob. What a weird camera angle for that. I can't see anything. This game is really dark. I don't want it to be too bright because then it won't be scary. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So... Where are the rest of the bags? <laughs> Why are the stairs blocked? And who blocks stairs like that? You guys are blocking that shit like something's gonna like come kill us later or something. I mean, you know. But like what? This place needs a serious overhaul. Oh. Jesus. What are you, pussy? It's just a fucking fireplace. It's a really cool fireplace too. It's on both sides. Oh, the bags are right. Oh my god. Why weren't they at the front door? Why are they on the staircase? The blocked staircase that I wouldn't even go to. Like what? All right. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god, you are so mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? I'm not gonna be oh, a dick. Okay, so now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just gotta take, Jake. Oh. Oh, sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme, I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 uh, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Mischievous smug. No, mischievous. Oh, sexy, huh? How does that camp by far? Okay, sure. Look, it was all settled by the girls in bunk seven, like second day of camp. It goes Ryan, me of course, then Dylan, Emma, Abby. Okay. Nick. Just Abigail, please. And... Okay, are you almost finished, please? Yep, that's it. That's everyone. Why is Abigail all the way up at the cabins? So she really cabins? just dumped her ass, huh? I don't. Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we gonna make this work? Different schools, blah blah blah. My whole thing is like, you know. Maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she has got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? <laughs> uh, it's just a fling. Oh, but I mean, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like a b stupid summer fling. What else did I think was going to happen? Uh, let's see. Uh, love, stability, engagement, marriage, house, kid, affair, kid, divorce, loneliness, child support, visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise reconciliation, emptiness, retirement, grandkid, 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 uh, nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. Hmm. Is that kind of the ballpark? Oh, shit, I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, here it is. Yours just says Roadhead. Oh, oh. actually, that's just a generic all-men list. Oh, that seems legit. <laughs> okay. So, are we sure that this... Caitlin is isn't buying it. Really? I don't care. We'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, if it doesn't kill you... Will make you stronger. God, if I had to hear that throughout this yes. entire game, I'm going pathetic. to kill hey, myself. Shut up. 
Uh, okay, so um, total hypothetical, but if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Guess we'll just have to find out. Don't do anything, dude. Wait, what? I thought he was like saying like, uh, someone sabotaged the van. But now the game is going to make me sabotage the van? Why? Is this dude that desperate? Dude, she's probably sucking one of the other counselors off right now, dude. She wants nothing to do with you. Why? Fine. Steel rotor arm. I'm... Can I have backed out or something? This is shitty. Come on with me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. I swear to God. If I could have. Like they're up to something. Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D d d Go along. Oh, dick! Oh, I got it. Boom. Oh. oh. There it is. Oh, Ooh. man. Good sight. Ooh. Freak. Oh. No, nah, stop. Oh. Stop. Stop. Oh, freaks. I'm surrounded by freaks. You're surrounded by a bunch of losers. Oh, no God. wonder his fucking girlfriend broke up with him. Technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? You know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped <laughs> an emergency. Dude. Oh, Ben. <laughs> got him. Yeah, at uh, least I okay, got well, some. At least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn. Now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hookup. Okay, okay, okay. Let's all put our little dicks away and get this show on the road, huh? Agreed. Where is everybody else? Why, why would I know that? I don't know. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any chick he wants. Okay, yeah. Keep dreaming, Junior. I don't like that I'm the one that sabotaged the van. Why did the game have me sabotage it? Why couldn't it have just been like a character that we haven't been introduced to yet and like it's a twist later that they sabotage it for a reason? You know what I mean? I don't... Uh, I don't want to play as Abigail. I like her hair though. Oh, an artiste. All right. Changed my mind. You're probably the loner nerd that's going to get murdered or she's probably going to lose her virginity off camera. Oh, hey, we both have tattoos on our right arms. Right on. All right. She's cool in my book. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Ah, oh, I should have just left her hanging. Oh, boy. What a quick You're time of that. You're back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked. Bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. How did you do well, that? It's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key. Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Leave bags, break in. Um. Sure, break in. Okay. Let's do it. We better not get in trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? He'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. 
One, two, two three. three. Oh. Wow. Path oh, chosen. The power. I'm just going okay. into the fucking cabin. Okay, what path did I choose? Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my god, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go Is ahead. she gonna get killed in his cabin? Pat, what do you mean Pat chosen? These look so uncomfortable. I can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. I can't believe you're not I don't know. <laughs> I have no words. Why would this place be in the news? Chapter 1, Camp Cabins. Newspaper headline scrap. Uh, scrap from the local newspapers, the North Kill Gazette. Wow. Uh, it doesn't look recent. Something about a fire. Was it here at Hackett's Quarry? Looks like there's three other pieces that could go with it. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Aw. It's just little Izzy's. Aw. Put it back. I want to play a game. I don't want to play a game. <laughs> Keep, leave. Leave. Oh, as I'll go. Oh my god. Keep. Fine. I'll keep Let's it. Get back to Izzy. Maybe I can throw it and use it as a distraction later. That's what my mindset was in. Path updated. Dude, this is... Oh, man. I'm... You're dead. Just pointing it out there. Abigail, you're dead. But you know what? That's okay. I mean, so far you're my favorite character just because, you know, we have matching tattoos. Or, like, you know, on in terms of arms. But um, your backpack's kind of lame. How much does that actually fit? Um, do I have to search every little cabin or no? This game is very, very beautiful. I will give them that. Hi, Crow. Oh. God, does that backpack actually hold anything? It's so fucking small. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. Hey, you can stop looking in the window now. Hi. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Oh! Okay. Okay. Hey, I got a great idea. Let's fucking leave. Yeah? Let's leave. Where are we at the camp? Hi, Abigail, you cutie. You know, I like how you dress. It's really cute. You got, you know, you got a little shorts. You got your little net leggings. You got a cute little band shirt, it might be. Something, I don't know, looks like a moth. The moon. It's cute. You got a cute little outfit on. I'm going to try my best to keep you alive. I know I gave you shit. And then like five seconds later, I changed my mind. But it's okay. Dude, what the fuck? Can I go in here? No, 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 no. I can't. All right. Um. Oh, cool. All right, let's go. Golf cart. Ooh. Yo, what up, girl? Ready to roll? Yes. What do you mean not? No, let's go. Let's do it. What else do I have to look Fine. for? I'm for sure I miss shit, Time but let loose and I'm gonna miss a lot of stuff. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. That's what people want. 
So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. Sure. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. So what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Oh. Uh, oh. Eyes on the road, lady. Sorry, sorry. I... It's been like left... It's been circling up the entire time. Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. That's actually really sweet. Oh, so, so you're just... You put it? Yeah, so you're just a piece of so shit. Like, we're going to school like four states away. I, he can do it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. Why don't you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. <laughs> email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, hold up! Oh, uh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp. Back to launch scenic route. Scenic route! Cause we're gonna see some fucked up shit. Sure, what's the victory? Two months, no technology. I kinda thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus my subs and me. What subs? Your OnlyFans subs? You look like someone with an OnlyFans. Nothing wrong with that, just looks like someone. Um... How could they live without you? No, I'll be supportive. I don't want to yeah. be a dick Actually, in this playthrough. Abby, was that a compliment? I can, charm is infectious. can I can easily take say? it back. <laughs> I'd subscribe. You better. As soon as you get home, sub, share, smash that like button. The holy trinity. Oh, well, now YouTube. Oh, no, you Do what she that. did. <laughs> subscribe and smash that like button. Listen to her. The lady that broke up with her boyfriend because she can't do long distance for a short amount of time. The island. Mad secluded, right? Mad secluded, dude. Is, is that smoke? Roar, roar. Should we tell someone? Hmm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should... We should probably, you know, give up. Oh, yeah. Worried Nick's, you know, gonna leave without you? Well, no. They're probably, like, all waiting for us. Mm-hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, is waiting for you. All, everyone. Okay, we get it. Nick and Abby should be together. Cool. Get it. Gosh. Ow. Okay. Heck, it's Quarry Summer Camp Entrance. Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so... Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude. Okay, this place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. <laughs> it's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? Okay, that's Who Nick. Would you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up onto the. Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because I mean, it's really not that big. She of a can deal. take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own. Okay, bag. we get it. Okay. We get it. Cool. I don't know why you guys can just th throw them into the van right off the bat. I don't know why you had to, you know, nudge. Sure, nudge. Uh, uh Abby, do you need? Yeah. 
nine. <laughs> yeah! Thank you. That fucking smile off your face. <laughs> hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. I'm here. <laughs> what are you doing under there? I'm here. Having a little me party. Uh, I was listening to a podcast actually. Oh, podcast, nice. That's cool. What's it about? Yo, mama. Is it about me? Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone <laughs> had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. Oh god, the dialogue in this no, game. It's, a, it's, it's something. Paranormal podcast. Yeah. This is okay. actually about this place, weird enough. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking, dumbass? Dude, she is such a... Hag of quarry. I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um... There's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a bunch of years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever, and then this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. What? Or kill you, or something. I don't know, it's never really been clear. Anyways. Haga Haggett's Quarry. You made that up. It's right here on the podcast, man. It's right here on the podcast. Oh, sorry, bro. Oh. Oh, what is that face? Better than yours. Oh, yeah? You got a cooler one? Oh, no. I wasn't being sarcastic. Sounded oh, like it. Tell it right. Look, no, no. Seriously, dude. I think it just it came out wrong. Well, you're already you be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Do bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Hey, hey. Yeah, 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 Mr. H. Up to it. Do we? Oh my God. The music <laughs> tries to Hi, match Mr. with. <laughs> yeah, to liberate some luggage. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh. <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Uh, understanding. I'm not going to yell at him. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. Interesting. I like how they had to stu do a little, like... Like a music cue for Mr. H for David Arquette's character, so, just like so in uh, Scream. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, uh oh, I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> bow, no, bow, bow, uh, bow. It's just, you know, about the whole thing with, with the. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Ease drop. What? The super kids. Then you short next to the. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have. Just hold your damn horses, all right? 
Everything's a-okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the air, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know what? I'm gonna wait. No, should I have? He's gone for a while. Try staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. Sorry, I, I wasn't. I wasn't listening. I, I was just like waiting. Like, I mean, I heard. Uh, I mean, I was. I didn't hear what you were. We're cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry, I pushed you out. Like Why didn't you? Just, oh God! Why didn't you just step away? You could hear him walking towards the door. Step away, throw in an earbud. Uh, look you like you're playing on your phone. Looking for the keys. Come on. No, end of summer. Busy, busy. <laughs> anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, it's a, yeah. whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. Her fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important. Right? <sighs> Dang it. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> Man, there's like something going on at this camp. So that like the uh, adults are well, keeping from us. What did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. Oh, thank you. But do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter? these terrified kids that they sent home. Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Fine. Sorry. Kids just need to have bigger balls, man. Got to understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. They're just Big stories. Part of being a counselor leader that's the p yeah. just stick to kumbaya next time okay What's no that's that? lame you guys don't do kumbaya anymore no good grief i'm outgrowing my own cliches telling ghost stories is a cliche everybody does that when they go camping seriously chris what's going on i just want to get you guys safely out of dodge before the sun goes down yeah No, I want to know why. Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. Sure. And safety is the first step towards fun. Just give me a minute. Where in the good goddamn are they? Where in the good goddamn? I was having a hard time looking for those keys. Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole <laughs> life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Huh. Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Put them in the coffee mug. Right where I left them. Uh -huh. Let's skedaddle. <laughs> Let's skedaddle. Boom, 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 boom. Bow, bow, dow, dow. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. The dialogue in these games are like bad, but it's fun bad. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. 
Hey, you should have turned it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. Oh my god. I know what they're doing with the dialogue. They're having fun with it. It's making fun I of like to dwell on the past, man. 80s it's horror good. movies, but come on. Because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. Well, the dude, I sabotaged the van. Ugh. Dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. All right, let me try. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing no, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough. <laughs> Enough, both of you. Shit. Come on. All right, dude, come on. chill. Dude, chill, all of dude. <laughs> All of this just to fucking get his girlfriend again? I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! I didn't want to sabotage the van, okay? Okay. Okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. <sighs> okay. Damn it. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. I got him. I got the keys. Hey, Brian. Come here for a sec. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you out on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Yeah. Yeah, dude, sure. Yeah. Sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. Uh... Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. Was that about he uh said to stay inside that we're not leaving until the morning are you kidding me um cool are you, you just kidding me? got what are we supposed to do well we should go inside like he said we could go inside until morning yeah yeah or, so let's do that or we could do something else oh we could just stay inside i know it's crazy but No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. <sighs> P-A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He's just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? He did seem freaked out. 
I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, dude, he won't even know. I, I promise. That no, 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 dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you, uh... The you group is getting bored of Ryan. No, I'm gonna be defensive. Yeah, well, someone's gotta give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris told Boo! me to do. Cool. Ryan, come on, man. Wait. Fucking weak chin. Look at us. All right. All right. All right. Hacketeers. Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um. Okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you go get some firewood. Uh. M and I will go to the stores. For oh some my supplies. god. And uh, Dylan, you just I don't know. Figure out how to charge the phones or something. All right. Let's do this. Dude, this this guy is like trying so hard to get his fucking hands on his girlfriend again. Like, dude, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Believe me, I know. What? Who the fuck is that? Why is he covered in blood? Hunting season. What? Why were they just covered in blood? I mean, we'll find out, of course. I was hoping you'd come back to me. Ugh, I'm not gonna do anything to you. Let's see what you found. Um. Empty handed. Yeah. You need to look around you, find my cards, and I can help you. Where I'm from, we look out for each other. Okay, I probably should have actually done that. Please. Okay, I'm sorry. You know, I just saw a creepy ghost in the window and you I just- be going. I'm good. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. Okay. And look out for my cards. Yeah, I, I do need to do a better job at that. I, I'm so sorry, ma'am. Fucking crazy bitch. <clears throat> anyway, I don't know, man. If you if the game actually thought I was gonna go around and loot, loot, <laughs> search every single cabin. Chapter two, truth or dare? Of course. Um, but if the game actually thought I was gonna go around and search every single cabin. You're fucking crazy, dude. I'm sorry, developers. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Mm. Will humanity prevail or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? <laughs> First course, filet au Jacob. Rich and full body, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Well. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god. Thank I'm you. I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. Kick door. Yeah. Whoa. And scene. Oh, I mean, I could have kicked it. Then you why didn't you? Me. Oh, 
Okay. So, if I were a beer, it's an actual store. I what? Having? I thought he was just kidding. Beep, 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 beep. What beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beard art, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> it's my beard art, dude. Wow, it's your really fucking like loser. Mr. H loved his accessories. Oh, a safe. No fucking shit. <laughs> that's like me looking at a door that's clearly so closed. Bad. Huh. I think it's closed. No shit. Oh. Oh. Hell yeah. Oh. Jackpot. Hey. Uh, Dude loves watermelon. Check out my giant melon. Oh my god. Can this guy get a bullet to the head? You just got a hole in it? Mm -hmm. Don't. You pour in your vodka. Oh, okay. <laughs> you just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in a watermelon. Or, God oh, damn it! I knew it. I knew he was gonna make that joke. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Dude is trying really hard and just completely failing. You're better off trying to get with uh somebody. Hi, Jesus! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this fucking dude was behind the counter, and then all of a sudden, he's just like. He's just like. Thanks for that fucking scare, dude. I thought he was still gonna be like. Playing with the watermelons. Dude didn't have to fucking do that. What the fuck? Okay. Thanks, dude. <sighs> Don't you have watermelons to put your dick into? Like, what the fuck? Hey, it's another one of them posters. Harum scarum? Harum scarum. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. Uh, he's supposed to promoting a traveling show called Harum scarum. The date is listed indicates that it took place over six years ago. Interesting. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh god, that camera angle. What was that? Jesus, this camp is huge! Who buys this crap? Dude, dumbasses, not too. Oh my god, okay, thanks. I just was looking out the window. Alright, thanks for that. You're gonna do it again? No? Just once? Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Hmm. Hello, old friends. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What the fuck? Scare Jacob. Can't pass up an opportunity like this. Okay. Have y'all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Because you're about to. Oh, that camera's gonna catch something else. Also, he is probably not that far behind you, so he definitely heard that. Oh my. <laughs> Alright, now where should I hide? I don't know. Jacob! Emma? Emma? Oh! Oh! oh. Look, if you're trying to scare me, it's not gonna work. Yeah. Ah! You want to get a coat? What? 
no, they're they're funny. You think this is supposed to be funny? I mean, yeah. <laughs> well, you think it's funny now, little boy? Okay, now you're just an asshole. You want to join plenty of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's no big deal? I. You break up with him and now you're going to tease him? Yeah. You're a shit person. Not forgotten. Man, exes that do that can burn in hell. <clears throat> anyway. I'm going to break up with you and then fucking tease you. Even though you're not going to get any of this anymore. Did I mention I'm a bitch? Alright, what are we looking for? I'm actually having fun with this. Quo too high. What's too high? God, the way they have the cameras set up, it's uh, not fun. No. Hack it history. Camp plaque. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blueprints for structural repairs on the lodge's chimney column. Judging by the scrawled annotations, this is not something Chris Hackett has the money to action right now. Interesting. Okay. Ah, uh, hold on. The game wants me to look for fucking cards. No, I'm kidding. It's like one of my favorite features of these games is like seeing like how you can prevent certain characters deaths and shit like that it's always fun and technically i did by not fucking with the fuel line i didn't start the fire dude stop standing in doorways what is wrong with you okay that did nothing are you really gonna sit here and tell me the game's gonna be like look for terror cards but then not give me any in this big ass area. Okay, back door. What about in here? Nothing. Oh God. Sorry viewers for this really not okay camera angle. All right, well, let's over here. I wonder where this goes. <laughs> Locked. Well, so is the other door. Can you kick this one down too? I'll call for Jacob. Jacob! Come check this out. You scream his name, but then you say, come check this out super quietly. Uh, Jacob! Oh, oh. Come oh, check this out. <laughs> door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Oh, righty then. <laughs> Done. <Ha>! Whoa. <laughs> yeah, let's just not break another door down. Whoa. Let's not fuck this place up. Good golly, Miss Molly. No wonder I kept this place locked up. Yeah, maybe for good reason. Kiss from your latest stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um, <clears throat> human rights or whatever. Sure, sure. No, if he wants okay. us to stay, then we have no, to. Let's see what we are working with. Hold that. Have shit the to door eat. Will latch otherwise. Oh, hell yeah! Watermelons. <laughs> In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. You're gonna lock me in here, aren't you? You gotta fucking do it, are you? Yeah, 
Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. Actually, yeah, what is this? Evidence. Everyone likes a scavenger hunt. And at Hackett's Quarry, <laughs> that's no different. There are secrets in these woods. Fun secrets that, should you uncover them, could help protect you from criminal prosecution. After all, the stories you'll take with you are only stories without the proof to back them up. So it's time to dive into the mystery, take pictures, or find pieces of evidence, and you may just prove your innocence. Oh! Or not. That's cool. That's a cool new feature. Jacob! Check this out. Alright, I like that. I can't move or else the door will latch. They look like camping supplies. Oh. Are they, um... Okay, um... There's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. The truth is, is out there. Pit? Torn bags. All right, that's cool. So if I find evidence, I can make myself innocent later if someone tries to get on my ass about something. That's a cool little oh, feature. Cool. What? What is it? Dude, missed a shotgun on the ground. Oh, cool. And a code. Oh. Seven seven three nine for the safe. Take it. Take it, take it, take it. Hey, it's not a toy. Okay. I'm done. <laughs> oh, she's actually going to take it. Okay, cool. I thought I was going to ask. I thought I was going to be like, do you want to take the gun? Actually, are we done? The game makes me want to think that we're done. But are we actually fucking done? I, well, we're done. There's no tarot cards. All right, seven seven three nine. So you're uh, you're really gonna keep the gun? Huh? Yes. Yeah. We're in a survival okay. horror game. Okay. Uh, well, I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. Cool. I'm gonna go get the ammo that's in the safe. I don't like hearing the little creaks. So can we fucking quit it with that? Pretty cool, dude. Pretty rad. Pretty dope. I think we got everything. All right. Seven seven three nine. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> you don't have to say that. I'm in. I'm in the pussy. What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. Oh, oh. fireworks. Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 no. Emma. Mm. Fireworks. Can I choose not to take them? I'm leaving the fireworks. I feel like fireworks are crossing a line. What? But you got a gun. Why can't I have firecrackers? Because the gun is for bear protection, and the fireworks could start a forest fire. Yeah. Stupid forest fire. I'm going to regret it. <laughs> Every time that comes up, I'm going to get hit with regret. bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. stop. <laughs> Stay right there. Hey, I know you found some weird <laughs> shit back there. Oh, dude. But I found that. Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. Okay. Peanut butter fucking butter cups. A butter pop, but the... What are butter, butter pops? <laughs> um, what are butter pops? What are butter pops? Uh, no. What? I can't Just it. no. Um, okay. Um. <clears throat> pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my God! <laughs> They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? He could have oh, transitioned no, 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 no. into not, something no, 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 super popcorn. sweet and they're cute like and, and, like and, and sexy. Subgenre of food snack. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? He could have been. Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old. Okay. okay. Look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. Well, you're gonna love them. He could have been like, oh man, these are like the best snacks ever, but not as well, good of a snack as you, uh, girl. He could have been stunt on something like that. Front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Yeah, this guy does not uh, deserve her. I'm sorry, what? Booty? 
Oh, it means like um, if he's not like gonna treasure do shit like that. Or buds. <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow. Uh, yeah. Wheelbarrow. Um, okay. Uh, it's like um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it. And just Does she not know what a wheelbarrow oh. is? I see. <sighs> Ladies first. Thank you. Do you not know what a wheelbarrow is? Yeah, he could have been smooth with that, man. That's what I thought he would. That's where I thought he was going with it. That's why I was being affectionate, because I thought he was going to be smooth with it. It's like, yeah, I mean, this is the best snacks ever. Not as good as you, because you're the best snack, man, but. Man, he's a good. But again, not as good All as right. you, girl. Could have just done something though. like that. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. Yeah, yeah sitting like at a desk. Sure. Just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Podcast. Yeah, podcast. Yeah. All right. God, this uh, guy's what's creepy. What's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, Bizarre Yet Bonafide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well, bona fide. Boner fide. Get it? Boner. <laughs> <laughs> Your wit knows no <laughs> bounds. So. Should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? No, uh, we should not. Snoop around. I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. <laughs> I mean, come on. What kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? <laughs> <laughs> True, I guess. Not Mr. H. I know. He's cool. Well, he's been cool to me. Man, Ryan's like, just like, dude, I don't... I just, I. Well, I wanted to read what was on the board, but never mind. Whoa, look at this old thing. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? So I can ask you on a date. Nice for somebody to call you. I'll flirt, sure. Uh, so that I can ask you out on a date. Mmm, uh... smooth. I think if I tried a cell phone number on this thing, it would just explode, though. Hello? What? What? Who is it? Oh! Uh, hello? It's weird. I thought I heard someone. Mm. Maybe you should have asked them out on a date. Damn it, I missed my shot. Ugh, I don't like that. I don't like it. There's two shotguns in this place? Aw, oh, man, we're loaded. Family photo. Kaylee and Caleb Packett. Weird kids, huh? I like them. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Hmm. Okay. Oh, hold on. It's a shot. Oh, I thought that was something. Sorry. Shotgun over here. Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris, Mr. H told me it was for, um, bears. Bears? Bears. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun. Dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just leave it alone. Leave it alone. Well, we actually. Um, what if bears crush up? No, I'll be serious about it. Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah, yeah. What? I mean, think about it. It's camp is over and hunting season has just begun. True. What? If, what if? Okay. Bear with me here. What if what's on the menu tonight is Bear us? with me here. Well, then I guess we would need <laughs> to protect ourselves. Exactly. That's why we need the gun mm. for protection. Yeah. Not going to happen. <laughs> what about for fun? No? Okay. 
Yep, yep, totally. We already have a shotgun. I just thought I could get my hands on another one. Well, we know where the gun is if we need it. Okay, that's true. We know where it is. Call, man. We know where it is if we need it. We know where it is. Well, hello. What is this? You hear that? Well, like, do you see that? It's obviously a hatch. Is that a trap door? <laughs> Secret sex dungeon. Guess it goes down to the basement. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. I'm not gonna oh. pull Last of Us 2. But why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Maybe it was here before this was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. It's probably for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Uh, okay, or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. <sighs> All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so. You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it, you climbed down. No, let's shut it for now. We, we'll just remember that it's there. I'm not taking yeah. that risk. I'm not going like to get another character kill. Mr. H is into. Path Mr. chosen. Is yep. Sure. The safe path. We already went down in that basement at the start. I'm not going to go down there again. Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to that. You that's... hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> that thing looks so uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Rain, rain, playful. He'll never know. Come on, he's not gonna know. Okay, just be careful. What do you think I'm gonna do? Break it? Come on. <sighs> oh. Oh. Did you actually break it? Because now we're probably gonna get killed later. Because we broke his chair. That's a design flaw. It's not a design flaw. You literally purposely kept leaning back. I saw you. Hey, let's not read oh. his diary. Laura Kearney and Max Friendly. Oh, yeah. Those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah. We're just now bringing yeah, it's it up. because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Counselor's ledger. Oh, I wanted to read it. I pressed L1 too late. Okay. Whatever. Well, I want to read that because that's actually interesting. <laughs> Clues? Evidence. I feel like if I would have went down there, then yeah, I would have been fucking killed. List of the council's names, personal details, and their task at camp. Two names are crossed out Laura and Max. Why didn't they show up? Because they were killed. Alright, is that it? I just want to make sure that I'm not. Er can't you like speed it up at all? I can try to encourage them. Go for it. You guys can do it. It's not working. It's <laughs> Go for it. You guys can do it. It's not working. I like this guy. What can I just try to talk to you? Nah, I'm good. Yo, my guy. Toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? Yeah, we've literally been doing oh, that. Sorry. Is that something that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har. Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's You're not a little bit curious? I'm <sighs> not going to touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... Oh, shit! Nothing but that. <laughs> you're using that wrong. Oh, I didn't have to do another quick time event? Okay. I get what the game's doing. It's like getting me like used to the quick time events and like having to do 
that so it's 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 a good way of like Fashion repeating it and like reminding me of how it works Mr. H but knows what he likes I'm sure he does wow that's yo hey hey maybe we shouldn't oh shit uh brian whoa what the fuck these monitors this is the camp huh. is mr h spying on us no no i mean no no he can't be these are just they're all different trails in the woods around camp <laughs> sure most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids, unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? What do you mean, what are these trail are cameras? Catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like, uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. Or to see if a kid has gone missing. I didn't know that Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you going to do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff yeah that's what a secret is <laughs> it, it's weird it's majorly yeah, weird i don't disagree with you but it, it's it's gotta be something juicy in here dylan okay. it's it's none of our business and if you really want to know you can ask him tomorrow I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation like at all okay yeah maybe i will all right i i'm leaving the secret layer have fun hey you just admitted that it's a secret layer is it really that big of a deal to have ca uh, security cameras at a kid's campsite to make sure that, like, like I look at it as, I mean, obviously there's more to it, but, like, if I was them, I'd be like, yeah, he has cameras set up. It's weird that it's hidden away, but um, it's for, just to make sure, it's like if a kid gets lost in the woods, you have a shit ton of cameras set up to see where he went. You know what I mean? That's how I look at it. Oh, I can actually like look around. What was that? Oh shit. It's probably nothing. This is the fucking biggest dumbass in video game horror video game history. You clearly saw a man walk up to the camera and disable it. And you're gonna sit there and be like, yeah, it was nothing. No, dude, come on, game. That's horse shit, and you know it. Hmm. The game knows it's horse shit. Come on. Hey, 32% and 28%. Nice. Oh, get through the door. Ooh. A guitar. Okay. <laughs> So there's got to be something else to this room. Jump scare. God, I fucking hate. I forget how much I hate like the different camera angles that this game that these games throw at you. Cuz one moment you can go through a hallway, search a room, come back and then there's just something there and it's mm. Whoa, there's some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. Ibuprofen. Yeah, there's nothing fun.
Why? You could have put something in that window. Nice. Full up. What? That's not full. Um. Heads a party, but just hey, keep them. Alright, cool. Let's no, go. keep them plugged in. What are you doing? Keep them plugged in and just go hang out with people. You know your phones Thank are left at. And if you're that worried, just hide them under the cushion or something. Okay, this old lady better not yell at me for not getting tarot cards. I've been thorough with searching around. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. And they're kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. <laughs> yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take every day. Which way should we go? Up your butt. Why don't you choose? Okay, yeah, Abigail is pretty cute. I'm not gonna lie. Shady Glade or Rocky Road? Ah, shit. Well, Shady Glade sounds pretty shady. But Rocky Road sounds pretty rocky. I'll go Rocky Road. Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Yeah, like burning or whatever. Think we've got enough? You barely went down the path. Uh, not yet. Your tiny backpack can hold a lot more. Come on. <laughs> following me yeah you are let's go fuck in the woods cause that's fun and totally not uncomfortable danger falling rocks oh fuck did I learn nothing from the tutorial are you sure this is safe what are you scared of falling no. rocks yeah are you no Giant rock just comes and smashes her fucking head in. Let's go this way. Get ready for some quick time events, Abigail. Oh. The Hain Man, the Hain Man. To be the Hain Man is to surrender, and by doing so, gain a new perspective. So look carefully and consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to be let go. In order to let go. Interesting. So what, one needs to be in danger in order to progress or something? Hmm. This game really wants me to go down these paths. I'm not doing that. Stick to the trees. I'm probably missing stuff, but I'm not in the mood to have one of these characters get their head crushed in so by a rock. You think about what's next? Like, after we die? Heavy, man. No, I mean like the future. Yeah. Sometimes. Never. You can't predict the future. All the time. It's overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to like let it happen, you know? Yeah, that's literally what you're what? supposed to do. Like you can't predict your own future. Is what was meant to happen. Yep. Like it's all predetermined. I want to say predetermined, but yeah, I'm not sure we're supposed to. Yeah, we're not supposed to know what happens in our future. You I'm never not, know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah, fate just seems so convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? Yeah, exactly. I never really thought about it like that before. It's an excuse to be a dick. 
I mean, well, it's it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. You can't predict the future, dude. What happens, happens. You can, you're not, you, like, one day you could just be dead. One day you could get in an accident. Like, you don't know what's gonna happen, bro. Okay, I like how open this game is, but I'm not... A fan. <laughs> yeah, dude. You, Abigail, you can't predict your own future. You never know what's gonna happen. Just live life in the now. Who fucking cares? Only thing you should be planning is a goddamn vacation. That's the only thing you should worry about when it comes to the future. Oh, I know where It's when you are. actually have to plan something that's happening down the road. Up here. I do like the soundtrack of this game, even though it's on streamer mode, but they still gave you a pretty good soundtrack, even on streamer mode. This view is just... wow. Make a move. Make a fucking move. Or let, yeah. Playful do me. No, being sincere. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. You're gonna find I out. I just don't know what. You'll figure it out. Oh, thank you. All right, now typical romance scene. You guys scooch closer and closer and closer, and then put your arm around her. What the fuck? Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. It sounds like a pig. It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. Is that a pig? Is that? Did I actually? Oh! <gasps> that is adorable. It's so tiny. All right, Abby. Um. Oh my God, he's so. Yeah, but was the <laughs> necessary? <laughs> oh shit! Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting scared by pigs. Save Abby. Oh! Oh, okay, okay. I gotta get more comfortable, or I gotta get. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Okay. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Is this a don't move the, the controller type of thing? Nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? I forgot these Watch games. The oh man. Or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Okay. Take the right moment and run for your life. Oh God. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just Oh, I also Oh no. Causing serious consequences. I also had to choose when to run. Oh go. Mommy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, little piggy hog. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Okay, that was funny. No, be cheerful. Listen, laugh, yeah, laugh with her. To tell her pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? I got a pretty good look. Ew! I think she was coming on to me. Aww. Got yourself a little girlfriend. She wasn't that little. <laughs> Almost as big. I'm kidding. That was. <laughs> oh man, that <laughs> would have been mean. I'm not gonna finish that because that's mean. So instead of it being like a, like an event where you had to tap, 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 like in the dark anthology or. Guess we should head back. Or an until dawn where you had to hold the controller still. I mean, it makes sense because this game is across multiple platforms, so you can't do the motion control type of gameplay mechanic. Well, technically, you should be able to. Like, oh, on PlayStation, you could do this mechanic, but on Xbox and PC or any other console, it's that mechanic, you know? Because that was my favorite thing about Until Dawn is like, hold the controller still, don't fucking move. I finally get my phone back, and it's just a big dumb brick. Why did you... Why did you go by yourself? Oh. Oh. I'm not a fan of this. It's very pretty. Fucking... I'm waiting for it, because I know this game. Like, I'm just waiting for it, dude. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. Chicken butt. H is oh. a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now. Back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He He's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? No. Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys exactly. No, we so, do uh, just. What's going on here? Everything ready? Weird light in the treehouse. Sure. I, I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Ryan. The hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. Well, you brought it up. Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Are you done? Hag of Hats. Hag. Hag. <laughs> I just realized we Fuck. never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. I was trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but. All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. Cool. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. The hog of, yeah, hog of Hackett's Quarry. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's Quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick-me-up. <laughs> what? Where did that come okay. from? Where, where did that come from? <laughs> Whoa! Ryan thinks you're making delivery. fun of him. I wasn't trying to make fun of him. I was just playing along. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun Jeez. come from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh, she I just mean, shot it. it. Done, but it's just for shooting bears. We got it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine. We'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, chip chip. Agreed. Guns and are no hand, joke, but still. We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Hey, hey, hey. Cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. 
Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. <laughs> if you know what I mean. He's <laughs> under the shotgun. What, you're going to shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Sharing is fucking caring. Not leaving you with a gun. Not a great idea. Well, why is it called mocking? It, but then the fucking option is not a great idea. But it's called mocking. There is no way I'm leaving you dill weeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Or just fucking go Dude, half and half. I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Don't cave in. Fine, you're on. God yeah, damn it. Boy. Jacob, hand me that gun now. And nobody's handling any firearms that's gonna act like a dick about it. Okay, then you can Thank do the you. Rest. We need an objective third party. Oh, oh my so god. Let's get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. No. All right. I guess we're gonna have ourselves an old fashioned shooting. Why didn't I get a. There's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but. If I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. Wow, you know, for a game about choices, I sure love that I got to choose on whether or not we go be stupid with a fucking gun. Okay, so, just so you know, I was an expert marksman. Third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know. That your goose is cooked, Nick. But if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. Peanut butter butter pop. Peanut shoot. butter butter pop. Peanut yeah, butter butter pop. Never shot before. Yeah, not that you know. Got it. <laughs> okay, I think I would know. If okay, you'd actually... boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. Dude, Brenda Sons acting in this game is actually really good. I'm always hot pencil. Yeah, okay, thank you. Bye. Bye. Like her acting in this is really good so, compared to the other actors. How's your little one on one with Abby in the woods? Like it's like their acting in this game is good, but like Brenda Sons is actually like like really good. Um it was okay. It was it was okay. Yeah. Had a boy. So hey! Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. Well, no, no, no. Hey, look, no sweat. Okay. We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man. Shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please just give me the gun. Uh uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Okay. So remember the spread, remember the recoil. Yeah. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight okay the i get why this is in the game now it's a tutorial whoa all right nick one point okay we're too far back to do any real damage let's scooch forward a little and uh fuck these guys up thank you good All right, Nick. This time for real. Okay. I forgot this game has the adaptive trigger feature, so it's gonna be really weird. Yeah. Nice shot. Thank you. Lucky. Point to you, Nick. Thank you. Good job, Nick. It's not that hard. All right. Especially on a controller. Actually, on a controller, it's pretty.
pretty difficult, especially in more stressful right. situations. You might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just I wasn't gonna you. fuck her right off the bat. That's the word. I thought you were an ultra elite pro. It's like the worst yeah, way to like start off right dating. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Dad, he's that someone shot. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey! You're disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No! Good game. Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I'm gonna <laughs> You're both very mean. <laughs> that was a good one. Oh, shit. Blam. You thought this was over? What the? Whoa. 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 Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter, pops. <laughs> Dude just got sh fucked. I don't know what I'm saying. They definitely got the vibe of this game, like, really perfect, like, to the T. It's, it feels like a real, like, camp horror game, you know, camp camper horror game. And the acting's not that bad. There's moments where it's a little silly, but it's not that bad. We'll really be putting it to the test when the scares start happening. Okay, that cutscene was way too long. Okay. New idea. Party game. Truth or dare? The actual name of the chapter? Come on, people, we might never <clears throat> see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies? Truth or dare? But Dylan style. <clears throat> okay, house rules <clears throat> are someone asks you truth or dare. Okay. Then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Yeah. That's normal truth yes. or dare. So we can, like, make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's returned, but... Well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so... Abigail. Truth or dare? You really dodged a bullet, huh? Truth can still be right. just as, Here like, goes. big as dare. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I... Uh, I... Interrupt. Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on. I, I'm not finished. Um... Have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? Okay. No. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, uh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. She just got her okay, turn. Okay. Talk um, about impatience. I don't know. Ugh. Ding, ding, ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan. Truth or dare? Did I get Did I get the option to choose or something? Um. Oh, dare. Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Can you do that? <laughs> I can do whatever can I want. Can you do that? And I dare you to kiss either Caitlyn okay. or Dylan. Oh. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry. I don't make the rules. And you literally <laughs> just did, but okay. Let's do this. Dylan. Dylan. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. There's already, like, something going on there. Always have it, please. There you go. Alrighty, who 
shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Caitlin. Caitlin. What do you say? Truth or dare? Truth. Yeah, truth. Let's see. Ever hook up with Jacob? What did you want to be when you grew up? Ooh. Ooh, do I want to... Do I want to cause some shit going on here? You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, I do. So you and Jacob go way back, right? Like since you were kids? Sadly, yes. <laughs> Same question, bro. Waste of a turn. You guys ever uh, get down to business together? When we were freshmen, I made Jacob let me practice French kissing on him. But it never went any further because he's a terrible kisser. And it was like kissing my brother. Right? Oh, okay. Nothing wrong Still with that. Bud. <laughs> okay, my turn. <laughs> okay. Emma, there. Damn, she was like, Emma, dare. Emma, you have to kiss. Oh, no. Oh, no. Jacob? Or... Oh. Nick? Uh. Oh, no. Well, then. Please um, choose Jacob. Uh, sorry. Nick is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. Don't. I please. Nick. No! Oh no, you know what you're doing! You know Abby likes. Um, dude! Seriously? No. You know we're. Guys. No. What a horrible friend. Guys! Wow. Thank you, Nick. Okay, do not get mad at him. That was He's all... Gonna... That was all her. What a... Bad person. <laughs> That's... She's not your girlfriend. It was just a game. Hey, I'm nobody's girlfriend. The fuck it was. It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. This guy has issues. <laughs> Grow up. Jacob has fucking issues, man. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. Yeah, you should. That was you shitty. Should go find Abby. Yeah. Just so. Anybody want to play part Jeezy? What? <laughs> okay, London Tipton. Uh oh. Oh no. Welcome back. I am, as always, delighted that you're here. What up, girl? So, then, what more has been found? Uh, I don't think you found much with your fucked up eyes. Got him. The hanged man. <laughs> yeah. To be the hanged man is to surrender, and by doing so, gain a new oh. perspective. So look carefully, and consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to let go. So one has to surrender. But these are just words. There's more to show you, if you'll let me. Of course. See more. It's the whole point of getting the cards, is to see more. Oh god, what's this gonna show us? Oh wait, what? That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again, you can count on that. Oh my god, I Be keep careful. forgetting, man. Where the wolves go... The ravens follow... I keep forgetting that this is like a choice game. Like, I, like, I'm, like, getting into, like, the whole, yeah, we're teenagers, we're camp counselors, we're having a fun time. 
but I keep forgetting that I'm gonna have to make choices that let these people live or die. Fuck. Chapter 3. Trouble in Paradise. Hackett Woods, Abigail. Stupid kids. What are we in middle school? Why should I even care? <laughs> Either I can kiss anybody. Stupid. Stupid. What the hell am I? And we'll find out in the next episode. This game is actually really fun. I'm enjoying this way more than Until Dawn. The music's good. The environment's good. The scares haven't really been there yet. But... There's been like little pop-ups here and there, but I'm having fun. I'm having fun with this. This is actually really fun. The acting's pretty decent. Every once in a while, it's a little silly, a little eh, but um, everyone's doing a pretty good job, and the story's pretty interesting so far. So uh, yeah, I definitely want to continue with this. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you guys did, leave a like, leave a like, leave a like, um. If you're under the channel, subscribe. Also, make sure you hit the little bell so you guys get notifications for when I upload to the channel. If you guys want to check out live streams, I highly recommend checking out my Twitch channel. I live stream over there as much as I can. So I highly recommend following me over on Twitch. Um, if you guys want to check out uh, previous games like this, I highly recommend checking out my Man of a Damn playthrough and my Little Hope playthrough. I actually think I still have to make a playlist for that. So I'm definitely going to get on that. So if you guys want to check out Little Hope, or Man of a Dan, I highly recommend that you do. Or check out my my Telltale Walking Dead playthroughs, um, because that's basically like this. Only it revolves, it's surrounded by the Walking Dead universe. So if you guys want to check that out, I highly recommend that you do. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.